Hey, what's going on, guys? We are back with another video. Sorry it has been so long since I post. I've had such a hectic summer, and I should be posting way more because this is summer. It's prime bass fishing season. So uh, with that being said, let's get into today's video. And today, or actually tomorrow, because it's 8.30 at night right now, we're going to be going after some bowfin because me and the girlfriend were out on some paddle boards, and uh, this guy was telling me he was hooking into like 10, 12-pound bowfins, and he told me a secret. So we're here at Food Basics, and we're gonna go get the special sauce. All right, so we're at Food Basics. I'm walking up. All right, so what we're after is in this aisle right here. Alrighty guys, we are here and uh, we're ready to get these sardines on the hook and get after one. It's such an active spot here. There's so many cars going by and my mic for some reason will not connect. Well, I know why because my, uh, my charging port is dirty and it won't go in all the way. So I'm going to have to get that fixed. But that being said, let's get a, a sardine on the line and get to it. Throw this on like that. And because of these bowfin, if uh, this bowfin uses his teeth and tries to break my line, he's gonna have a little problem. Cause this is all steel here. This is what you call a leader. And it's for basically for teeth with, or fish with teeth. So they can't break your line. Alrighty, so we're gonna tear into these fresh sardines here. See that crack? Yummy. Nice frozen sardines. Yeah. <laughs> and we're just gonna take a pretty decent sized chunk out of this. Hook start to peek through. We'll break off this end piece here. Throw it back in. Go clean the mitts off because that is nasty. Maybe we'll take this little piece, trim off the water. Yeah, one more won't hurt. Now we're gonna take our trusty sardine here. Frozen, of course, or else it would not say on the hook like we learned last time we were out here, eh, baby? All right, so we're gonna set it up here. It's out there in the water, about 10, 15 yards offshore, just like Buddy over here told me last time I was here. He's the one who actually gave me the hint. And last time we were here, he got hooked onto another one when that whole video got deleted. So uh, we're here for round two today and hopefully we can make her happen actually. Cause our problem last time was we did not freeze these and they just fell off the hook. So learn a lesson, froze them this time. Should be good to go. Fix your posture.
So, it may be a little bit windy right now, so I'm gonna talk close to the mic right here, okay? So, right now, I've been sitting here for almost two hours right now. Lauren's getting pretty impatient. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, so, we're gonna check this, because it does look like it's tighter than normal right now, my line out in the water. It used to have a lot more sag to it, so uh, we're gonna get see what this is saying and that's our last sardine on there so you know what folks this, this might be an unsuccessful video i might not have caught anything but the whole objective here is just to let that sit out there and those bullfin will just go right along bottom and usually they'll uh sniff out that stinky sardine and uh just gulp her up but that has not been the case and i've been looking over at the guys fishing next to me for bullfin too and uh they've not got a single bite yet so tonight bite tonight the bite might not be our luck nothing nothing it's not looking good all right guys unfortunately after two two and a half hours of sitting there Watching my rod in the water, I have finally uh, found out that that type of fishing is not for me. I will go sit in a boat for eight hours and cast for bass or any type of fish, just casting. No fish like that. But man, throwing bait out there and just hoping that something swims by and catches it. <sighs> I don't think that's for me. So we're going to chalk this video up to an L. Who knows? If you guys leave a comment and you want to see me do this again. Maybe I'll do it again, but if that doesn't happen, I'm probably not gonna be doing that for a while. So, you're welcome. If you didn't like today's video, I'm sorry. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching. And as always, like, subscribe, leave a comment if you want to. Thanks for watching today's video, guys. Peace.